Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm pretty far away I know because I'm unboxing the the uh, car seat. Yay! So the funny thing is this guys. I ordered the Upper Baby Mesa or Mesa Mesa which I love but I end up switching out um, strollers. I was waiting for the 2020 Upper Baby vista to come out in february which yes is my due date <laughs> uh but i end up switching to the silver cross which i'll do an unboxing of that too i'm really excited when that shows up but i had just found out about it and so but the upper baby mesa is not compatible to it the nuna pippa is so switched over to the nuna pippa and let's unbox it Oh, excited oh my gosh you know they won't let you leave the hospital without a, a um, car seat which is of course good but just yeah oh first rise safe travels so guys this is the Nuna Pippa flame retardant free car seat and base and it retails for $299.95. I got in the caviar, the black, and this, I'm glad this came in gray. So, you know, I'll know when we need to wash it because I wouldn't know that with the black, you know, if she spits up or something like that. Now, let me say this. Um, the Mesa, one of the biggest reasons I love the Mesa is because these right here you don't have to you didn't have to adjust take the whole thing apart and adjust whereas the nuna you have to do that as she grows um which kind of sucks but that's okay and i really wanted the other car the other stroller obviously uh this is this right here so the nuna has two other car seats as well the nuna Pippa Light and the Nuna Pippa Light LX. And one of those comes with the merino wool. This is not merino wool. The Mesa did come with the merino wool, uh, the one I was getting. And so I kind of missed that. But again, that's okay. <laughs> I've made a few compromises to get this one outside of the Mesa because I really want the other car, the other uh, stroller. But this is also the reason why I got this one though, instead of the other two, the other two are really light. This one is actually, um, this weigh eight pounds. I believe the light one weighs like five point something pounds, but the problem is that they aren't airport seat compatible. So whereas I can, I don't have to use the base for this. I can actually use this just with a car seat belt. I always like that option just in case so it's called no rethreading so yeah this is I have to rethread on this um, talking about moving it up with the size of the baby I'm trying not to compare this to the Mesa but I am <laughs> another thing one more thing that the that the Mesa has that this doesn't have is back here so the Mesa the back part is all lined with like a soft felt. So it doesn't per se ruin your leather in your car or whatever. But they say it still shouldn't ruin your leather in your car. But this is the one thing this has that the Mesa doesn't have is this extra. I don't fully know how to use this as yet, just to be clear. That's why this is an unboxing. <laughs> this is a stability thing that helps with the if you get in a car accident the impact so this is really this is really something nice to have you don't have to use it it's optional but i mean i i probably will use it because it's there um and ooh, hmm Do 
I just push that down? Oh, I don't know yet. So I'm just going to let it be. <laughs> um, and then it has these right here to tell you. Ooh, has these right here so that I know that it's level. The car seat is level for the baby or not. And so that's beneficial. And then... These buttons work with, oh yeah, so I'm able to push this in. Oh, and this is right here. I don't know if this is real leather or not, but this is real sleek and looks nice. And then you have the car seat. Let me push this back down. Here we go. pretty that is you have a little sun visor right there pull it all the way down oh oh I guess I should turn it to the side this looks real sleek right oh and then what does this zip out to the zips right here oh that's nice okay so and then I just if I want to put it back I just put it back in here and zip it oh okay oh and then we have a air vent right here in peekaboo that you can see the baby and this is all Velcro, so this Velcro is right here. And in the back, I gotta figure out what all this stuff does, right? <laughs> but this is nice. This is real sleek. And this is an infant car seat, and it actually goes from four to 32 pounds, up to 32 inches. And it's a true lock installation that takes just five seconds, makes the base easy and quick to install. Seat also installs without the base with vehicle seat belt. And the best part that I really like is the fact that I can just click this on and then just click it off and then put it on the stroller. So she's sleeping, I don't have to disturb her rest. And I'm gonna have to figure all that out. But this does have the latch things on there. Let me turn it around and take this off. And it has these, it has these latch things. So if you're putting it on the passenger side of, in the back of the car. Yeah, this is really nice. I like it. Now, of course, guys, this is this is an unboxing and not a review because the baby isn't here yet. <laughs> the baby is not here yet, and I I don't know, you know, how it performs or what have you. But this is just exciting and me showing you the baby stuff I'm getting. So, yeah. I hope that was helpful if you're looking at car seats and trying to figure it out. I would recommend looking at the Mesa too, but the Mesa isn't compatible with a lot of uh, strollers. Um, so, yeah. But this is still nice. So, yes. I hope that helped you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Yes, I'm going to take down the Christmas tree probably today or tomorrow.